So yeah, just to, I guess I have a bit of explaining to do. I have bipolar, and that means I get depressed, but on the other hand, I also get manic. So that explains the flight of ideas I had in the Einstein was wrong, but I was manic video. Now, I personally love being manic, so I'm totally out of control, and I, I have no sleep. I can't get to sleep, so it's not entirely all good. But there's never a more creative time in my life. And through it, I truly believe that I did figure out that Einstein was wrong, that indeed energy equals mass, and that's as simple as it gets. You don't have to say energy equals mass times the speed of light squared because there is no dimensions. There's just us. There's just the universe, you know, and that's the beauty of it, that even a child can figure this out. So truly, I believe that uh, Einstein was the elephant man, that in because of it, our society is um, built in that way. And so we have nuclear power and we have nuclear bombs. You know, we are not supposed to live so large. Um... And it's because he saw the world as the dyslexic person sees the world. So if you have dyslexia, then I don't think you would have a problem with living in this life. But because I don't have dyslexia, I do have a problem. I really don't think the world is a better place because of nuclear energy. Um, like I say, I believe his biggest problem was that he thought that thought experiments were good enough that you didn't need to find... Um, correlations with the earth and with actual physical matter you know that truly was a huge error Be because of that I believe he spun us um, in a, into oncoming problems that never would have occurred if he never existed so I think it is true also that he was the Antichrist because the Antichrist, I think, is supposed to be Jewish, and he was Jewish. And if there was one person that you, if you got rid of in history, would change the world the most, it'd be Einstein, except other than Jesus Christ, right? If you got rid of him and there was no theory of relativity, there would be no nuclear bombs. And we would also be at the end of physics. We wouldn't have to keep on searching for a unified theory, because it would all be unified naturally. So, forgive me if the previous video took you back, took you aback, and maybe was a bit uh, too crazy for you. But like I say, I took that video when I was in the throes of mania.